What's happening, fam? Um, L.A. Y'all movement still moving. Um, book is entitled Lessons from a Non-Custodial Father at Amazon, Kindle, and Create Space. Link will be in the description box below as usual. Um, this video is entitled Black America, Stop Moving the Goalposts. We have a big, big problem with this. The things, the ideologies, the ideologies that we had in the past affect the present, right? And instead of saying, yo, we're in this spot because of what we thought in the past, that ideology didn't work. We, we come to the, to the end of these ideologies and look at the failures created and then we just move the goalposts and say something else. Or well, it'll fix it. No, 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 no. You can't keep doing, we can't keep doing it. We can't keep doing that because what's happening is ultimately we're ignoring how we got where we're at and we're not fixing the problems that that, that ideology caused. We're just making up a new ideology as we go. And that's a problem. You know, it's why shit keeps progressively getting worse because instead of uh, uh, handling the situation, we're, we're collectively sweeping shit under the rug and then making up some old shit and then buying a new rug. Can't happen. Now, I'm, I'm going to get on everybody with this shit. There was an ideology. The ladies have this ideology. You know, I, we, we you haven't built anything. We haven't you, you haven't protected or provided for us. We don't respect you. Okay. So you're just going to ignore the I don't need a man. I'm an independent woman ideology in that, that whole era. Because if you was part of that, then... You didn't need to be protected or provided for, and if it, it didn't work out for you, and now you want to be protected and provided for, um, then that's the thing you gotta fix. You know, you can't just men, what are y'all gonna fix that? I'm independent and I don't need no man, and 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 now that I'm now I need a man, it's your fault. No, you gotta address. You can't move the goalposts. Motherfuckers remember that shit. Fellas, you out here looking for, man, I ain't got no real women out here. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. You know, where, where, the, where the real women at? You wasn't saying that shit 10, 15 years ago when you was in love with a stripper. You wasn't saying that when you was at the club and these girls making it rain and you wanted threesomes with chicks. Now you looking for some nice wholesome wife? Oh, you gonna we just gonna forget about that part, huh? But we're gonna fast forward and it'll work if we had polygamy. Your threesomes didn't work. The fuck is you talking about? The strip club didn't work for you, but now you gonna now you gonna get wives? You gonna go from from the chicks you know, the, the strippers and the thoughts and the hoes you knew, and the threesomes you had with the bisexuals, now all of a sudden. You gonna make them wives now? Come on, dog. Come on, dog. No. 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 You see, this is what I mean by we gotta stop moving the goalposts. Because I'm not talking about everybody individually. I'm talking about certain segments specifically. Because certain segments and factions were down with the bullshit and it was fun, but now they made up some new shit because they bullshit didn't work. The community taught these young girls, go to school, get an education, you don't need no man, never depend on no man. That's what they were teaching the girls. You know what they were teaching the boys? You're just a boy, you're on your own. You're a man now. You just turned 12, you're a man now. You're on your own. So now you're looking for what? So you're going to act like you told the, 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 the girls when they were girls not to depend on a man and, and the men weren't shit. And, that, and they weren't even women yet. They were little girls. So guess what they looked at the little boys as? Boys that wasn't going to be shit. That they couldn't depend on. And now they're grown women. And they're like, but I need a man. I thought I, I wasn't supposed to depend on no man. 
See, part of this ain't their goddamn fault. But what, what we gonna do? Just gonna sweep it under the rug and act like that ain't a problem. And then the boys, you you know, oh you you on your own. You a grown man. You can do whatever. And then years later, we gonna why these men don't have no skills? They they, they always just bumming off of women and they don't do shit. They not employed and they don't have any employable skill set. You told them they was on their own when they was twelve. The fuck are you talking about? But we just gonna move the goalposts now. Really? Really? You know, we're we going to act like that shit didn't happen. But we got all... But everybody knows what I'm saying is not a lie. You can't tell me I'm lying about what I'm saying. All y'all going to... If you got an issue with what I'm saying, well, I didn't grow up like that. I wasn't like that. Did I say... Was I talking to you specifically? I said earlier in this video, I'm not talking about individuals. So if you give me that individual shit, shove it up your ass. Here's another thing. You know, we got a lot of type 2 diabetes because two things happened. Technology increased to the point where we weren't outside as much. But the other thing that happened, our diet, you know, our diet was cool back in the day because we did a lot of manual and physical labor. We did a lot of walking as adults. You know what I'm saying? We didn't do that no more. So all that, eat, eat all the soul food, eat your plate, eat, your, eat all the food. And you had the foods packing these big ass plates and eating all this shit you shouldn't be eating. You're not burning it off no more. But you got to eat that soul food. That's why your ass dead. This is the problem right here. We still eating soul food and too much of it and not moving. Nobody's, they're not moving. You're not walking places like you used to. And you wonder why it's type two. Excuse me. Because you kill, we're killing ourselves with the old soul food diet ideology as if we move like them people back in the day. And you wonder, I don't know why. I don't know why. I feel so bad. Bitch, you've been sitting in front of the TV five days eating shit you shouldn't be eating. The fuck are you talking about? We're going to move the goalposts. It's just genetically modified food. Motherfucker, didn't nobody tell you to eat five pounds worth of food per sitting? You could eat a, 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 a normal portion and be just fine. You don't have to eat three huge meals every day and, and sit on your ass all day. Okay. Another ideology. I don't want my kids to. I want my kids to be better than me. I want them to go to school and get an education. Here's the problem. Education and what? See, there was an era that we forgot. People wanted us to. You, I want you to be a lawyer, a doctor, an engineer, a nurse. You remember that? You remember that? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. And, but now. You know, and you look down on the people that was the janitors and the garbage men. But now you don't tell people to go to school to be a lawyer. Just go be whatever you want to be when you go to school. And now you're wondering why. Why don't we have as many lawyers and doctors and engineers as we used to and inventors? And what happened? Because you sent your, school, your kid to school and told them to do whatever the fuck they want to do. And they, they took the easy way out. They... Like, when y'all parents was on, y'all head about, you know, you're going to go be something. We ain't taking, you know, accounting something. We, we ain't going to send your ass to school just to send your ass to school. But now we want to act, this is part of the issue with people going and graduating and not getting any degrees in STEM. You know why? Because nobody told us to get degrees in STEM. That just had to be your interest. But now we're moving the goalposts. We keep winding up somewhere and acting like, I don't know how we got here. Oh my God, it's so bad. Hey, this, just, this just happened just yesterday overnight. No, no reason. Fuck out of here. This ideology that, you know, oh man, you know, the drug dealers and the criminals, they are the, they are the smartest people in the community. And now, I'm saying, 
old drug dealers and criminals ain't got shit to show for their life of crime. When the brothers gonna come back and help the community? They didn't sold us out. Wait, what? So you don't you act like you don't why is the community fucked up? Is the community fucked up because you was dealing drugs in it? And you was committing crime in it? And you was happy then, you was getting making money at that, right? And and for the people who wanted who didn't want to live their life, they moved out, right? But now you want those people to come back because you not doing crime no more, so you say, and you've changed your life around, and now you, brother, I need you to help the community because I fucked it up, but I don't want nobody to know. <laughs> what? This, this is what I'm talking about moving the goalposts. We are one. No, we not. No, the fuck we not. No, the fuck we not. But y'all don't want to act. Y'all want to act like it's something other than it is, because we keep moving the goalposts. We gonna act like it was an error. These kids, you know, all my dad did was go to work, and he was mean old dad. And you know, we having a mama, we just just my mama was just fine. Then then generations came up. Yeah, yeah, I, I could be a mother. You know, we don't need a man. Okay. I could be the mother and the father, okay. And now we're, you know why we're struggling and suffering? Because your daddy's not here. No, motherfucker. No, no, you're not finna play that game. You bought into the, they don't need no dad shit. I can do this by myself shit. I'm the mama and the dad shit. And it ain't really, and I'm, I'm going to say this because I'm going to get on the single mothers on another video. But I'm going to say this about a lot of these single mothers. It ain't really partially their fault. This was a family thing. They are, they're, they're, they are family. Those, those single mothers, extended nuclear family or extended family, they don't, they the ones with it. Oh, we got this. We, you don't need no daddy. We got this. We're going to take care of you and the baby. And all you motherfuckers failed. And now y'all looking around. Well, your daddy should have been. No, bitch. Shut up. Shut up. Don't, don't blame daddy now because y'all spent too much time and effort making sure daddy couldn't be in them fucking kids' life. You can't tell me I'm lying. But what happened is you want to move the goalposts. And that's the problem right now. We're gonna to have to stop. If, if we wanna 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 move forward, the, the first thing we gotta to do to move forward is stop moving the goddamn goalposts after we done fuck some shit up. It's fucked up. This is how it got fucked up. This is how we gonna fix it. Now we're gonna move the goalposts and make it some other shit. I ain't even enjoying my soda. Fuck it with y'all. I'm out.